Hey guys, my name's Leonhard, and I had a different type of video that was originally supposed to be posted today. However, it's Sunday evening, and every single Sunday evening, I get a little nervous just because it's the winding down of a weekend, the new work week's about to start, and you kind of just like don't know what's ahead. What I really wanted to get and why I ended up posting this video instead, it's because of the subject of bullying. And I'm, I'm already getting like really emotional right now and I have no way. Okay, well, it's, it's Sunday evening and I'm on YouTube and one of the, like somehow I come to this other YouTube channel of a young 13 year old kid, a boy. And I was like, oh, it uh, has something to do with a, like a po another popular YouTuber or something. And this kid only has like a few hundred like subscribers or something I think or maybe like a thou a couple thousand I think and they were posting their videos and I watched one and I was like this is really weird like the stuff that they were doing were like trying to be funny and like these skits and stuff and honestly it was a little weird but the editing and the quality of it was actually pretty good like I, I, I read like the comments and I saw the dislikes on the video and it it just like, I was like, why was there so much hate on this young kid? But I would go through it and I would see the kid was actually responding to the hate comments and actually ended up making another channel. And that channel has almost 10,000 subscribers. But on that other channel, they kind of let that channel rest in peace. And this new channel, they were still getting a ton of dislikes on their videos, but they just kept on going. He kept on posting videos. He even did a video where he was responding to his haters. And this is a 13 year old kid. But what I'm kind of just getting way more emotional than I think is that the fact this kid, this young boy is 13 years old and he's doing something that he loves and that's entertaining people that watch his videos. And I know anybody can pick up YouTube and say, hey, look, I'm entertaining people. But the editing and everything for this, 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 the guy that his videos was is actually not bad and he has good camera presence. Yeah, he's a little bit odd, but that's what makes being human and being unique individuals awesome. And I, this kid continues to persevere through all the hate, all the negative comments that he, the dislikes on his videos. One video had like 43 likes and like 400 dislikes, but the kid keeps on making videos. And he seems like he's having so much fun. Sorry. It, sorry about this. I was not expecting this. I, did, I don't know who this kid was. I never had any interaction with the person that had this channel, but it, no matter what you're going through in life, to see that this person just keeps on having, doing something that they're passionate about, and they keep on going, pushing through all the hate in this world, and there's a lot of hate in this world right now, but I can just, it, it's relating to me because I, I, yes, even my videos get hate and get dislikes and stuff and it's natural, but that kid keeps on going. I want to keep on going no matter what happens. And I hope anybody that watches this video and gets, and gets through me crying, which I was just doing or tearing up, never give up on your dreams. Never give up on your goals in life. Be true to who you guys are because that is what us, that is what makes us awesome people. And please, and please, if you're thinking of making fun of somebody or making somebody, make, feel, making somebody else feel bad, please try to put yourself in their shoes and what they're feeling and how you would feel, how do you feel, and just don't do it. Now, constructive criticism is a completely different ball game, but making fun of people, no matter their age, no matter how they look, how they talk, just from, from my heart, I ask heart, pun intended, to heart squat, 
I just ask, I humbly ask, please just have a different outlook on life. Get both points of view before you make an opinion, learn as much as you can, and then tackle life head on. I, 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 if that kid somehow watches this video, uh, I think his name was like Elixir, I, uh, I wish you the best. From myself that has, a guy that has almost 200,000 subscribers, you inspire me. You inspire me to make better videos. Whenever I'm feeling bad, I think of you and your channel and how you persevere, never letting the haters get to you. I know it's tough and it's, it will be tough. Life is tough, but you and anybody else watching this, you can persevere. We will persevere. And I wanted to thank that uh, Elixir person for for making your videos and making somebody like me feel a lot better. You guys, yes you, I keep on looking at the camera because I'm still trying to get used to my new camera, but I, I'm not looking in the camera, I'm looking over there. But you guys, the hashtag hard squad, have meant the absolute world to me because yes, I do go through the comments and you see me hearting your comments and every time I heart a comment, I am reading the comment. And I respond to several too, but there's just, you know, there's hundreds and hundreds and thousands of comments. I can't respond to everybody, so I'm sorry for that, but you guys continue to go out in the world and you guys make a difference. And that's what I love about this community. That is what I love about you guys, the heart squad. You guys go out there and you make a change. And we're not just here in the US. There's people tweeting me on Twitter, messaging me everywhere, from everywhere across the world, from cultures that I would have no idea how to act and interact with. But you guys, no matter where you are, you go out there and you take on life by the horns. I don't even know if that's a saying, but you guys do. This community does, the Heart Squad community does, and I'm sure there's plenty of other out there as well, but for talking to you guys, you guys, you guys make this channel. And I don't know why I wanted to switch up the videos, but sometimes I just like talking to you guys. I like being real with you guys. And I'm once again, sorry for crying on the camera right now. That's a little bit, uh, a little bit personal, but honestly, when feelings come out, they come out. And I'm real with you guys uh, in this community and I want you guys to be real with me. If there's anything I could ever do better for you guys, please do let me know um, if it's more hate I don't know, private message me instead of publicly doing it because, you know, there's younger people and I want people to come to the Lean Heart channel or Twitter or Instagram or Facebook and when they come see my videos, I want them to have and be in a positive environment and experiment experience. And that's what I'm hope and hopefully I as a YouTuber, as a Poketuber, as a entertainer and as a human being, hopefully I'm setting the right example for you guys. I love, I love doing somebody who's like just Instagramming me. I'm getting out of it, I'm getting out of it. I love doing videos for you guys. It's been like almost two and a half years now since I've been doing videos. I don't have any plans on stopping. In fact, I'd love to do this full time. However, I'm still doing my actual job full time right now, but I'm completely digressing. I wanted to thank that Elixir kid for, even though he's not directly like affecting me, he's indirectly affecting me by continuing to persevere through the hate. Just keep it up, I'll keep it up. Everyone in the heart squad, keep it up. And I hope you enjoyed this random video. Please do leave a like if you enjoyed it. My name is Leonard. Stay awesome, stay positive, and as always, I'll see y'all in my next video.